Hey everyone, so I'm Helen Terry and I'm here at Soma Ranch and I'm with the Rockstar team who have really expanded Soma Ranch all around the world. Um, we're just having a little chinwag getting together at the end of the year sharing what we're grateful for and, and anything else we want to share with each other and also um, we actually started this conversation and I was like, hey, can we hit record? And I think some people out there might really like to hear this too. So that's why we rewound. Um, so my gratitude is for the team. My goal and my wish, uh, my desire was to create a program where I could step away and for the program to be able to sustain. And I got to take 13 days off. Today is my first day back teaching um, after 13 days. And I was sharing how it's one thing for all my classes to be covered. And in that way, we can say that the program sustain. But on a deeper level, what I really appreciate is how participants continue to show up, to share, and um, how the teachers did such an incredible job. So um, big thank you to the team for um, really we wanted to go from a me to a we. And I think we really have achieved that this year. And I'm really um, grateful for each of you individually and for y'all as a team. So thank you. Elaine. I, I'm super proud and I look at the difference from how I felt in January of 2023 and, and the pressure and the, the spaghetti and all the things and, um, the fact that, and I said before we hit record that I used to feel like I was subbing for you and I've learned so much from you and, and grown so much. Um, and that it was called up that you're not subbing for Helen. You know, this is, this is you stepping in and teaching the class. And, and it took me a while to take ownership of that. And now I feel at the end of 2023, it's like, yeah, I get to show up there and do what I love. Um, I found the Boxing Day, uh, class just a really nice finisher for me for 2023. It felt like, privileged to be there for Boxing Day, even, you know, whoever was celebrating Christmas, and just this gentle, beautiful movement. And, and afterwards, I was like, that's how I roll. And, you know, trying to put me into a different get moving box, just is not going to work. So uh, Boxing Day quietly worked well for me. Yeah. I think all of us have found our brand within, I think our brand is to deliver really quality programs where all people that are full of heart that want to help people. And yet we're all very different, unique. So I've enjoyed part of your brand, bringing the poems that you bring at the beginning, the consistent through movement, we find help, health as we um, step in. And then, yeah, your beautiful, gentle healing approach. It's wonderful. So thank you. Thank you. Paul. Cool. Well, um, so this was my first year of teaching Nia from, so, I started in 2022 in December, I taught my first class. So here we are 2023, it's been one full year of teaching uh, NIA classes. Um, and I'm so grateful that I was part of this because come um, heck or high water, I was expected to show up and teach. And for me, that's like, okay, I have a deadline, I have a, I have a job, I have to show up, I have to do. and. Um, and I'm also really grateful that the, the safety and kindness and joy of the community has allowed me to kind of nurture my, um, and I say this with all the love in the world, my own inner weirdo, like, oh, I have this thing, I wanna do songs with this sort of thing, or I wanna do play with just all smile line, all class smile line. Like I get these like little hamsters in my head saying, it's about this. And, and y'all and the community have just been like, bring it, bring it, do it, bring it. And so um, uh, my uh, inner weirdo is just delighted to be here and uh, and hopes, and I do believe that I've also like stepped into like teaching Neo Classic as well. Like I can do this as short and calm and, and cool. And, and, uh, and so, so a lot has happened this year and I'm just, I'm truly grateful for the consistency, which was important for me, uh, and the support. So, 
Yeah, well, thank, thank you. you for thank you for your inner weirdness. I I love that, and I love your creative spirit. I think part of the Paul Duff brand is like you took my fun Fridays and um, and really played with evolving that into several things, like the fifty two moves shuffle. I, mean, I don't. I think that's even like I think you came up with that phrase perhaps, but the. 52 moves shuffle in 30 minutes, I think is genius. And I think also it's like, you found one of your things, like your improvisation and your comfort with that and how you deliver that. And um, and then how you've and done continuing education too, how you did your Ageless Grace certification and bringing that into what you're doing. So yeah, here's to many more improvs. And I did like today how I felt like there was that conflation of you and I doing a duet the beginning of several, I think, you know, playing with each of us doing a duet with each other as part of 2024. And yeah, it really has been a wonderful year seeing you evolve as a new teacher. It's cool. Natasha. Yeah, well, this has been the highlight of my year for sure. I think I've shared with the team, I, I showed you my calendar before and Every time I got scheduled to teach a class in the 30 day challenge, I put a big red heart around that date. Um, and it, it just gives me something every month. There, there are lots of things that I look forward to every month. And this is the thing that I look the most forward to every month. So it just, it helps to keep me really like anchored and, and grounded and rooted in, in, my, in my sense of joy and passion. Um, and I was, I was before our call, I was reflecting on the year I was, thinking back to everything I've taught throughout the year. And then I was thinking about my favorite classes that you guys have taught throughout the year. And I was reflecting on the retreat last year. There's so many, so many highlights. And I think for me, it's been so fun to, um, to go on a little bit of an adventure. Like I, I love teaching classic Nia choreography. In fact, just last night I was thinking, wow, I haven't learned a new routine in a really long time. It's time for me to really dive into, you know, Nia on demand and, and find a new routine to learn. And it's been super fun to teach 52 Moves with the Timer and my very first Blue Monkey class and uh, creating my own choreography and adaptations, like all that stuff. So I love... I love the balance. I love having like a 50-50 balance between structured, you know, tight Nia choreography and then and then playful creativity as well. And teaching five stages has been so special too. That's been incredibly healing for me. So wow, wow. <laughs> what a journey. And I you 2023 has gone by in a flash in, in some ways and then other in other ways it's like wow it's been so rich and so full and there's been so much awesomeness so I'm looking for forward to another year yeah thank you I definitely think part of the Natasha brand coming in at the beginning of the year I would have said your um your dedication and devotion to like classic near choreography you already had several routines under your belt. And, and I like the, the preparation that you put in and how that comes through in your delivery. Um, like if you, I really do find you, um, you know, tight but loose yeah, on that. But what I think really has, I'm glad how you shared it, that your brand I think has really evolved this year into really shaking things up for Natasha. Yeah, And my highlight with you is definitely when I, you know, you asked it, you had the idea, and I like that as well, that you've really initiated some really creative things. And that blue monkey for me with you, that, that, if you ask me what was my highlight with Natasha, the blue monkey, the whole process, how you delivered that, and even the strange circumstances that day that something happened and I had to exit. It's like so many, it was for me, that was just a moment of life, you know, of <laughs> just, Really, so yeah, thank you for being so creative and coming up with the ideas and how you have evolved as a near five stages teacher too, for me is like your voice and your delivery. And there's a lot of things that go to being able to teach a near five stages class well and you hold your own on that beautifully. Thank you. Gigi. 
Um, well, as the newest member of the team, I'm just grateful to be here and so grateful for the support that all of you have given me. Um, and what Elaine said about, no, not subbing, because I have definitely thought of myself as subbing until very recently. Um, and when I finally started to feel like, oh, I feel like I'm becoming my own teacher now and not just trying to do the things I was taught to do and, you know, by both of my amazing teachers and all of you that I'm learning from. So I'm excited for the next year and learning more routines and doing more fun things. So I'm grateful, grateful to be here. Yeah, I think you're doing awesome already. You've only taught a few classes and you've already just seen the improvement. And I, I think you're right. For me, I think you've I, something I really, I think I've always enjoyed about how you move and also how you teach is how grounded you are and, and you've really got the foundation. You know, you've, you've got the moves down and I feel now you've really, like you said, you've, you're finding your Gigi brand and I really hope, particularly when you're here, you know, it's not, oh, Gigi's subbing for Helen, it's Gigi's teaching. I think more and more Thursdays can become your slot, yeah, and... Um, yeah, I, I'm so glad it's, I don't want to be substituted. I want some people to be alongside me and, and showing their brilliance. Yeah, it's kind of funny too. Like, I don't want to be substituted. <laughs> I want to be playing with you guys all the way through 2024. So um, thank you so much for sharing. And um, I'm really excited for what's going to happen in 2024. I think definitely... Well, help me out if I forget anything, but definitely we're talking about doing more jams and that that was certainly a highlight for all of us. I like that all nodding heads. So we're doing a, a jam in, um, for Valentine's, for Freedom around July time and Thanksgiving around November time. And I definitely want us as a team to have a goal that by this time next year, that we can duet and switch song to song to song to song as seamlessly as we can now cue choreography whilst playing the music, yeah? I wanna be as skillful as that with all the spaghetti of what's involved of doing online jams. And I think that's, remember this moment, this time next year, and let's see how swiftly, I think we're gonna learn a lot of things as we go along. What else for 2024, anybody else? Getting into Stoma Ranch in less than a month. I cannot, like, I just signed up my guest and I'm like, and on the 18th, you'll probably see us right in Stoma Ranch. So, yeah, I'm pretty excited about that. That's been the, I got to get to January. That's what my goal has been. So I'm this close. So Awesome. Yeah, mid-January, the whole team's going to be here. So sometimes I'll be teaching and all y'all will be behind me here. And we're going to do some jams. And I think Kelly and I are going to do a duet. And um, yeah, I'm really excited about you guys being here. So cool. Anything else? All right. Well, we'll click off. But um, if, if people are watching this, thank you for watching this so far. Um, I think um, just from all of us on the team, I just want to say a big thank you to anyone who shows up and takes class and and be aware for us and any time you take a class somewhere that we're all human and those little messages afterwards and the feedback and the suggestions um it all really um sustains us and supports us and so thank you so much for being part of this